What's up guys, it's Christian back at you with another Thursday video. So this one obviously as you can tell by the title is a how to be a YouTuber video. So I know that there's quite a few viewers out there that are probably like, how do I start a YouTube channel? And it's pretty easy, but still, you know, it's always nice to have a little bit of guidance. So obviously you want to have a camera. I can't show you the one that I'm using because I'm using it, of course. I probably could pull up a picture of it, so I'll see if I can put a picture in if I can, and it'll be right there, there, somewhere. Uh, but, like, uh, any camera works. We'll start out on their phones, and then they go on from there. Um, so using your phone, or a laptop, or your PlayStation screen if you're doing live streaming, or your Xbox Connect. Um, so that's the first step, obviously, is having something to be able to record with, and then editing. You don't necessarily need an editing software, however, it makes things a lot easier. I use Movavi Suite, um, and then there's YouTube editing software, which is very difficult, but if you don't mind difficult, then it's the thing for you. Other people use like Premiere and there's other stuff. I use Movavi Suite, although it's, I think it's like 80 bucks, I'm not sure, but I'm pretty sure, well, it's 80 bucks to upgrade it and whatnot, but it, that's... You know, so if you don't, if you can't get the editing software at first, just kind of try to do it in one shot or do it in bits and then try to cram them all together. You might have to just start with live streams or recording on your PlayStation because I know that my friend who has an Xbox, they have the editing software on the Xbox. So uh, I don't know about PlayStation because I've never really recorded. I've done live streams on my PlayStation before, but I've never like recorded video with, from my PlayStation like pre-recorded wise but maybe there is if there is let me know in the comment section down below and uh, then you can teach the others maybe so uh there's that and obviously you want to have like a plan of what your channel is going to be about though so maybe before you get all this equipment start planning okay i want to be a blog or yeah blog or vlog channel or i want to be a comedy or skit channel or i mean vlog pretty much covers like everything in a full statement but you know, most people are expecting when they get vlogs, they think, okay, he's going to be going somewhere and this is that story, or maybe there's a skit in there every now and then. But, um, like, you want to know, if you're going to do, like, a comedy channel, then make sure you... Because it'll tell you when you start your YouTube channel, it'll say, hey, is this, a, like, an entertainment purpose, is this a vlog purpose, or is this, like, a, you know, whatever. Music, or, <laughs> you know, whatever the situation is for you. Um, so make sure you have that figured out before you start, you know, putting stuff together, and then decide a posting day. So I don't recommend doing daily when you first start, because that becomes very, very hectic really, really quickly. And even doing it once a week is kind of gets hectic because you know you got stuff that goes along, and you gotta edit everything, and you gotta put it all together, and you have like a week to do it, or maybe less than depending on the time you pick it. Uh, I do mine on Thursdays, as you can tell. Uh, because you're here every Thursday, <laughs> but, you know, like I said, they'll pick a day, maybe one or two days, or slowly progress into one or two days, and then progress into daily if you feel that you can do that. Don't, you know, you don't want to go head over heels and then everything starts falling apart and then you don't know what to do with yourself. So, you know, just start off pretty slow and then build up from there. Um, and then comes like you know the more you get with it, the more or the more experienced you are, and the better it becomes. So like you get more music, and you get more fans, and then fans start submitting stuff, and then you get answers, and then you get questions, and then you get more answers, and then you get more questions. But uh, you know it's a lot of fun, uh, and you don't want to start your YouTube channel with the expectation of I'm doing this because I want to become rich and famous, because odds are you probably aren't going to become rich and famous. There are some people that have that expectation and somehow come out on top, and more power to you. But in my opinion, I, I would do it for fun, because if you're doing it for fame and glory and whatnot, then it's not fun, it's just a job. But if you're doing this for, you know, for fun, then it's not a job, it's a fun activity, it's a hobby, really. But, you know, hey, 
if that's what you want to do, though, I mean, that's what you want to do. I'm not telling you how to do your, your channel, but, you know, that's, my advice is to do it with, uh, you know, happiness, fun, make other people happy, then they'll make you happy. It's just kind of a goes around, comes around kind of thing. So, uh, I know this is a short video, but, you know, I figured how I could help other people who want to start YouTube channels is to kind of give them a little bit of, of a helping hand because, you know, my buddy Luke, who's a YouTube channel, I have to say thank you to him a lot because he's probably one of the main, like, uh, he's not just the only main reason. There are many reasons why I wanted to do this, but having friends who are on YouTube channels that help you out is a very, very useful thing to have. So, you know, thank you to Luke, thank you to Ryan, uh, which I'll have their links in the description down below. But obviously you guys know my story from a million times of me saying the reason why I got put in here is, one, because of my friends. And I forgot James, I'm sorry James. <laughs> You're in there too, but don't worry. But um, the, one of the main reasons why I'm in this channel is, uh, or I started this channel, it's because of my friends because they were all starting this channel and whatnot, and then I saw this video from Sam Goldbach, which he was kind of talking on his own about, you know, things he was enjoying and whatnot from the past, and to kind of give, he gave me more excitement to do the channel. I mean, not that my friends were, because my friends were always like, are you ever going to start this channel or no? And then I was like, all right, I better start it now. Uh, but, you know, so if you need that push, you know, here's that push for you. <laughs> but I mean, don't, like I said, I'm not just trying to throw it all at you and say, all right, go and do it. Um, you know, it obviously it takes time to put yourself together and figure out what you need to do and all that fun stuff. But, you know, once you get going, don't stop. Just keep going. And people are going to try to bring you down. And that means you're starting to become a pretty good YouTuber. If people are starting to say, hey, you suck or whatever, don't, don't listen to them. Because they're jealous. And I don't know why they're jealous, they just are. That's just how people are sometimes. But, you know, you just, people are going to try to break you down and you can't let that happen because as soon as that happens, as soon as you miss one episode or one video, then you start kind of going, well, I missed the one. Maybe I'll get back into it, maybe I won't. If you don't get back into it, then people are start going to, you know, you're going to stop helping other people because maybe something that you're going through is going to help somebody else get through something that they're going through and maybe your YouTube videos might convince other people to think about situations that they wouldn't be thinking about normally like happy situations uh, you know you might be helping somebody get through a hard time you might you, know, you never know what your channel is going to do I mean I, I've answered many many questions from people who are having just a lot of stressful situations and I'm glad that you guys felt comfortable with sharing that kind of information with me. And that just goes to show you that even when you start off small, some of the people that are watching you are having a hard time and you can help those people through that hard time because, you know, through comedy, through answering their questions, through just your channel in general, you, you never know what people are going to be, you know, in kind of a situation wise where they're going to need, you know, some help or some guidance or just a friendly face to see on their channel so uh, you know that's what I got for you uh, so be kind be weird but give somebody a hug today <laughs>